This video tutorial is provided by the College of Graduate Studies at UCF. In this video, I will review the requirements for the references section of the thesis or dissertation and demonstrate how to apply the appropriate formatting within the Word document. Each source cited in the text must be included in the list of references. References may not include items that haven't been cited within the document. Refer to your discipline style guide for specific entry formatting. The heading title on the references page should be centered in all caps. Reference entries should either be single spaced with an extra space between the citations or double spaced with no additional space between. Don't use the word continued as a heading or an indication of multiple page references. References should appear as the final section of the document, or they may be collected by chapter. If collected by chapter, that section should be treated as the last subheading of the chapter. First, I will demonstrate how to format references with the single spaced option. In your Word document, turn on the Show Hide All Formatting button to reveal the formatting already in place within the document. Select the References text, and then under the Home tab, go to the Paragraph section and click on the small arrow in the lower corner to open another menu. In this menu, you can change your indentation to hanging unless your style guide specifies a different format. Under the Indentation section, go to Special, click the down arrow, and select Hanging. The preview window should display the hanging indent. Since this is for the single spaced option, go to the spacing section and change the line spacing to single. Because an extra space is needed between entries, change the spacing after to 12 point, which will insert one line of space. Click OK to return to your document. For double-spaced references, you will follow a similar process to the spa single-spaced option. Again, begin with turning on the Show Hide All Formatting button to reveal the formatting already positioned in the document. Select the References text and go to the Paragraph section under the Home tab and click on the small arrow to open the Paragraph menu. In this menu, you can change your indentation to hanging unless your style guide specifies a different format. Under Special, select Hanging, and this should be displayed in the preview window. For the double spaced option, under Line Spacing, change from 1.5 to double, and make sure that the spacing after is set at zero point, as well as zero point before. Click OK to return to the document. This concludes the video tutorial for references. If you have any further questions, please use the Format Help section of the Thesis and Dissertation Services site. You may also refer to the PDF instruction file, appendices, and references. For more video tutorials, please return to the Graduate Thesis and Dissertation web course.